Welcome to our channel Storm Rider. The USS Zumwalt, DDG-1000, represents one of the most ambitious leaps in naval ship design and technology of the 21st century. As we look toward 2026, the Zumwalt-class destroyer continues to evolve, integrating new weapons, sensors, and mission systems that are redefining what a modern warship can do. Designed by the US Navy and built by Bath Ironworks, the Zumwalt is not just a destroyer. It's a statement of futuristic warfare at sea. Measuring around 610 feet in length and displacing roughly 15,600 tons, the Zumwalt dwarfs traditional Arleigh Burke-class destroyers. It was engineered for stealth, versatility, and multi-mission capability, blending cutting-edge design with advanced combat technologies. The ship's sharp, angular shape immediately sets it apart. Instead of the familiar silhouette of traditional warships, the Zumwalt looks almost alien. Its tumble-home hull slopes inward from the waterline up to the deck, minimizing its radar cross-section. This stealth profile allows the massive ship to appear on radar like a small fishing boat, significantly reducing its detectability. Combined with radar-absorbing composite materials and smooth exterior lines with minimal external structures, the Zumwalt's radar signature is astonishingly small for its size. At the heart of the Zumwalt's innovation is its integrated power system, IPS, one of the ship's most revolutionary features. Unlike conventional gas turbine systems that directly drive propellers, the Zumwalt's engines generate electricity that powers everything on board, from propulsion motors to weapon systems and sensors. This all-electric approach gives the ship over 78 megawatts of power, enough to supply energy to a medium-sized city. Such a massive power reserve enables the Zumwalt to operate advanced radar systems and opens the door for future weapons such as electromagnetic railguns or high-energy laser systems. This electrical flexibility makes the Zumwalt one of the most future-proof naval vessels afloat today. The ship's propulsion system consists of two Rolls-Royce MT-30 gas turbines and two Rolls-Royce RR-4500 turbines working together to generate both propulsion and onboard power. The IPS drives two advanced induction motors that provide quiet and efficient thrust. This design makes the Zumwalt not only powerful, but also remarkably stealthy underwater. Traditional destroyers have significant acoustic signatures, but the Zumwalt's electric drive makes it difficult to detect using sonar, giving it a distinct advantage in submarine warfare and anti-submarine operations. In terms of combat capabilities, the Zumwalt is equipped with a vast suite of advanced systems. Originally designed with two advanced gun systems, AGS, each capable of firing precision long-range land attack projectiles, LRLAP, up to 60 miles. The program faced cost challenges as each LRLAP round became prohibitively expensive. By 2026, the US Navy has shifted the Zumwalt's focus toward next-generation hypersonic weaponry. The ship is now being refitted to deploy the conventional Prompt Strike CPS system, capable of launching hypersonic missiles traveling over Mach 5. This transformation positions the Zumwalt as one of the Navy's key platforms for rapid global strike capability, capable of engaging time-sensitive targets with unprecedented speed. The Zumwalt also carries 80 vertical launch system VLS cells along its hull, designed for a wide range of missiles including Tomahawk cruise missiles, evolved Sea Sparrow missiles, ESSM, and standard missiles for anti-air and ballistic missile defense. The placement of these cells along the ship's perimeter, rather than in a centralized cluster, helps improve survivability. If one section is damaged, others can remain operational. For close-in defense, the Zumwalt integrates advanced radar-guided guns and missile systems, while a suite of electronic warfare systems provides protection against enemy sensors and missiles. The ship's radar and sensor technology are equally impressive. The Dual Band Radar DBR, system, which combines X-band and S-band radar functions, provides long-range air and surface detection, even in adverse weather or heavy clutter environments. This integration gives the Zumwalt an unmatched ability to detect and track multiple targets simultaneously. From aircraft and missiles to small surface vessels, the radar's stealth integration within the ship's structure further enhances survivability by avoiding large exposed antennas. 
Inside, the ZoomWalt offers a futuristic operational environment. The Total Ship Computing Environment Infrastructure, TSCEI, links every system from sensors to weapons to a single digital backbone. This networked architecture allows operators to manage the entire ship through touchscreens and integrated consoles. Crew members can monitor propulsion, radar, weapons, and navigation from a central control area, resembling a high-tech operations center rather than a traditional bridge. The automation on board reduces crew size significantly. While a Burke-class destroyer requires a crew of around 300, the Zumwalt operates with about 140 personnel. Fewer crew members mean more space for advanced systems and reduced logistical demands for long missions. Living conditions on the Zumwalt are also a major upgrade compared to older ships. The crew quarters are more spacious and modern, featuring improved sleeping areas, gym facilities, and recreation spaces designed to enhance morale during extended deployments. Noise reduction systems make the interior quieter, contributing to both comfort and operational stealth. One of the ZoomWalt's most unique selling points is its modularity and capacity for future upgrades. With vast electrical power reserves, spacious internal design, and open architecture computing systems, the ship can adapt to new technologies as they emerge. Future updates could include more powerful directed energy weapons, next generation radars, or improved unmanned vehicle integration. The ship already supports the deployment and control of unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, and underwater drones, making it a flexible platform for reconnaissance and electronic warfare operations. In performance terms, the ZoomWalt achieves a top speed of around 30 knots, about 35 miles per hour, which is impressive for a ship of its size. Its range exceeds 4,500 nautical miles at 20 knots, allowing it to operate for extended periods without refueling. The ship's design also enhances stability in rough seas, an important advantage for maintaining stealth and accuracy during operations. Despite its technological marvels, the ZoomWalt program has not been without challenges. High development costs, complex engineering, and changing strategic priorities reduced the planned fleet from 32 ships to just three. Yet each ZoomWalt-class vessel serves as a testbed for innovation. The Navy has used these ships to experiment with new combat concepts and refine technologies that will shape future classes of destroyers and cruisers. As the lead ship, USS Zumwalt DDG-1000, has become a symbol of transition from traditional naval power to digitally driven sea dominance. By 2026, the Zumwalt has found its place in the modern Navy as a platform for hypersonic strike capability and advanced maritime control. It bridges the gap between surface warfare and strategic deterrence. Its stealth, power generation, and networked architecture give it a unique edge in a future where cyber warfare, autonomous systems, and precision strike dominate the battle space. Whether operating independently or as part of a carrier strike group, the Zumwalt serves as a force multiplier, capable of providing long-range support, gathering critical intelligence, and executing coordinated attacks with unmatched efficiency. For viewers and naval enthusiasts, the Zumwalt represents a bold vision of what the future of warfare at sea looks like. Its stealth design, electric propulsion, and digital infrastructure push the boundaries of modern engineering. Even if it came with a high price tag and a limited production run, the technologies it pioneered are already influencing the next generation of U.S. Navy vessels. The Zumwalt is not just a destroyer, it's a floating laboratory, a demonstration of how power and stealth can coexist in the same platform. As it moves into full operational deployment with hypersonic weapons and integrated systems in 2026, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 stands as a powerful reminder that the future of naval warfare is already here and it's sailing on stealthy electric waves into uncharted waters.